Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, tonight I thought I would just do a some hits and misses and some just makeup I've been absolutely, if I can get my drawer open. One second. Ugh, there we go. Um, and just some stuff I haven't been loving. I haven't been, um, I haven't been using and stuff like that. So, it's gonna be makeup and skincare. So, the first thing I, I can't seem to find an oily skin primer that actually keeps me matte for more than an hour, which sucks because, uh, you know, and I don't want to be blotting all the time. I've got really oily skin now, like really oily skin. And I didn't used to have oily skin, actually. It used to be normal to dry, and I was like really, really oily. And so these are the two primers I've been using kind of. Uh, this is Shine Control, and this one's like a pore minimizer. And I, I don't know if it was the foundation that I used with this or if it was just this. But this did not hold up when I put on, and it's a bummer because this foundation is like one of my favorites. It's absolutely flawless. I love this foundation, but it got oily, which is such a bummer because I adore this foundation because it instantly blurs, blurs lines, wrinkles, and smooth skin. So like with this primer and this foundation, like. I looked airbrushed, like you can see a flaw on my face. I was I was loving it, I was digging the look, and then about an hour into it, I was so I was oily AF like no other. <laughs> and it was such a bummer because this is like one this the, the this duo is amazing. Like, oh so I don't know, I gotta I, I put multiple things on my face to get it. I mean, the 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 simple, the the less part, the simple. But like, I don't put on like a ton, a ton. I just put on like my my primer, my foundation, my blush, my contour, um, my and then I do like a powder, and then I do my highlight, and then I, I do like a, a finishing powder, just to kind of even everything out and stuff like that. Sorry. I'm, and so it's not like I complicate things. And uh, this seems to make my oily skin worse. Like I spray it on my face and it like makes it worse, which is weird because it says all nighter. You know, it said people with oily skin. Makeup shape bottle well hold eight to ten inches away unmissed. Unified. Oh, maybe that's why you should actually try shaking it and then like spritzing it in like an X because it says two to four times in an X and a T formation. So T and then X. So that makes uh. sense. Sorry. So that makes sense. Um because I uh, I don't like this. That was my leg. Sorry, my my leg um, makes weird noises. Um, I have a prosthetic, so it rubbed. Um, anyway, so it seems to make it like worse. And so I don't know if it's my skin type. Like if it's just like too oily. But there's a couple of things that do work on my face. Um, like I like the all-nighter foundation this I like a lot now if I don't use it with a primer see there's, there's a few foundations that I don't use with a primer and it seems to work fine you know like ones that claim to be 24 hours like uh, what is it? This, one. this one I don't use with a primer and it works just fine like this is like the only foundation that I have found in the drugstore that works. So I'm gonna try this one without a primer. I haven't yet, but I like the coverage and I like it, but 
I don't think it needs a primer in order to like stay on because it claims to be all night. So I'm gonna use this and then you know keep using this because I love this and probably definitely repurchase it. It's almost empty because I use this a lot because it's the only one that'll seem to actually work. So I don't know what's going on. If you guys have any suggestions or anything, please leave them in the comments below to let me know what what the heck I should do because I'm lost. Help. <laughs> um yeah. Oh, and this is my absolute favorite contouring kit. This is like my go-to contouring kit when I'm in a hurry. Because I like the little brush that it comes with. And it looks like this. I might like purchase it because, you know, Black Friday and Thanksgiving and all that coming up. So, and I usually go shop on sale. So I might pick up another one of these so I can, um have a backup <laughs> but this I love because I love the brush and then I am a medium cocoa it smells so good it smells like chocolate and it even tastes like chocolate I actually put my tongue in it once like I, I didn't like that and I licked my finger and it tastes like chocolate too I know probably not the best thing to do but it smells so freaking good and so I can do this medium this medium cocoa whoa without it being like too dark like it's perfect for me like it is like the perfect shade for me look at that like look at that like it's like the perfect shade for me because it's not too dark i can even do i don't love this highlight i mean it is pigmented let me just kind of oh mm, well actually see it's kind of like a glitter like it's kind of a glittery highlight i mean it's perfect for me because of my uh, oily skin you know i want a little bit of a highlight but not a bam and so this is like the perfect contour kit i love this um it's something i've been using for a couple months now it's like my go-to contour kit i don't like to use anything else really except for this so and i don't know how much this product is gonna last me you know i use this like a lot so i might go pick up another one just to kind of have it a backup so that way I can go out way don't run out because this is like my favorite thing ever. <laughs> um let's see here. I don't like anything too hot, like translucent on my skin. Like anything like um I like this highlight. It is a highlight. Like, look at that. Like, that is a highlight, girl. But it makes my skin, like, ten times oily. Or, I mean, it is a highlight. Like, boy. Like, look at that. Like, that is a highlight. Like, and it, it stands out. But, and I try to use it as much as I can. But it just makes my skin look so oily. But look at that highlight, though. Like, look at that. Like, compared. Like, oh my gosh. Like, this is a highlight, girl. This, this is an amazing highlight. But, unfortunately, it makes me look a little bit, uh, shiny. I'm not, I'm not, look at that. Look at it. Come on. And this is what happens when you layer it. Like, it even looks more intense. Like, oh, It's a gorgeous highlight. I love this. Except for, it makes me look a little bit shiny. So, the Too Faced one is perfect because... It gives a little bit of sh a little bit of shine without me looking like I'm a really hot mess. So, um, this blush I just got from. Hold on, 